Welcome back to Marriage Beyond the Veil. So, I have a question. Mm -hmm. How important do you think it is, or is it important at all, to have a sense of humor within the love relationship? No, I think it's important to have you, you, part of the humor. Yeah, you have to. <laughs> yes, I know. You have to have a sense of humor. You have to? Yeah, I don't, Why does th one I don't have think to? that you can survive through this world in a relationship if you don't have a sense of humor. And I would concur a whole 100%. Um, you know, having a sense of humor, because it can get you through some difficult, challenging times. Mm -hmm. um, and it's easy to laugh at others, but you definitely need to be able to laugh at yourself. Oh, yeah, without a doubt. I mean, you know, when you just think of some of the silly things that has happened in our 34 years of marriage. Um, what silly things are these? One was marrying you was the first silly thing that I did. No, that was the best decision you've <laughs> ever made in your life. And that's no joke. Continue. Yeah, so we can talk about some things. <laughs> While she cracks herself up. <laughs> Look, and by the way, she learned that from me. <laughs> I did. Um, no, <laughs> having a sense of humor will definitely help to navigate some of the most challenging situations and circumstances. Mm -hmm. And again, being able to, to laugh at oneself. Because I think many times when there's challenges in relationships, it's because one, if not both persons, take themselves too serious. Yeah, that's true. Um, and I would say that in our relationship, you know, you're definitely the funnier of the two. Although I've gotten better as I've gotten older. I would agree with both um, of those statements. I am the funnier of the two <laughs> and you've gotten better. It does. I put lighten, in a lot of work. Yes. It does lighten the load. Mm -hmm. And I mean, it can take turn, um, take a really tense moment and lighten it tremendously. Yeah. Well, you know, and, and during those challenging times when uh, my natural funny comes through, and Gail is naturally funny too, mm -hmm. uh, whether she knew that or not, I just think I helped her to discover that. But um, I call those moments comic relief yeah. because, you know, when, when things are really uh, challenging and difficult and, and if it's consistent, you need something to break it up, mm -hmm. you know, or you'll break up. Yeah, that's true. I don't mean the relationship, but it could go there too. Mm -hmm. You know, um, we need to have those opportunities to exhale, to let off some steam, to just be able to step back, particularly at most difficult time, and, and get an opportunity to see with a panoramic view. Panoramic view, which means... No. <laughs> Call somebody, you know. Boom, boom. Um, <laughs> See, he cracks himself up. <laughs> yes, I do. And I've been doing it yeah. best part of my life. Yeah. I'm good at it. Yes, you yes. are. And that's what I do. I don't always find him as amusing as he finds himself, but. That's because her her sense of humor isn't great as mine. No. Any rate, we digress. <laughs> uh, do you have opportunities where you can see the value of being able to to uh, lighten the mood, the moment, to be able to step back and not to approach everything so rigid, so, you know, so uh, aggressive, but to understand that sense of humor, you know, because when you laugh, it, re it releases endorphins. Mm -hmm. I mean, all these pleasurable things. And so it is a part of your wellness as well. Mm -hmm. It is. It definitely is. It absolutely is. Mm -hmm. So what about you? Do you have opportunities where you laugh? Do you have opportunities where one is funny, one thinks they're funny? <laughs> As you can see, mm -hmm. even in this message, mm -hmm. look at the joy that I'm experiencing. <laughs> <laughs> and it's contagious. Oh, so, yeah, you and your list. understand the value mm -hmm. in really being able to laugh at situations, laugh at one another. Yeah. Um, laugh at yourself. But to lighten it up. <laughs> lighten it up and enjoy the journey. Until tomorrow, if the Lord says the same. Have a good evening.